Yo, what's up guys? My name is Noxel and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're doing things a little bit differently than just reacting to a normal video. Now, as you guys can see, we are here with a mask on and actually I'm just showing my face. That's the only thing you guys really need to worry about. I'm sorry if it's a little muffled and I'm trying not to speak too loud, which I probably am speaking too loud, so I should probably lower my voice. But how you guys all doing today? Let me know down in the comments down below. Also, if you want to check the original video to what we're going to be reacting to today, be sure to check the links down below in my description along with my Instagram where I upload daily anime content. Like I was saying before I got rudely interrupted by a uh, notification that you guys did not see. Uh, Asta, Magna, Luck, and Finral um, are all four people in the Black uh, black Bulls in Black Clover. Now if you guys have never seen this anime, well, spoiler alert, so just stop the video now. Come back when you finish Black Clover episode 80. And you can see my reaction to this along with your guys' reaction. So yeah, anyway. So in this today's video, we are going to be reacting to all of the Black Clover. Uh, bowl saving Finral. Now, if you guys don't know who Finral is, he is a spatial magic user who gets really injured by his own brother who is younger than him in a fight um, when they're doing the tournament to see who will be the Royal Knights. And yeah, uh, let's just say he's not one of them and neither is his brother because of what his brother does. And basically, his brother's about to go ahead and just kill his older brother. And it's just because he kind of got, he's kind of infected by by the elf thingy. Like he's, it's a lot of gisting and description and explaining. So just if you want to be sure and definitely know what's going on, definitely just check Black Clover out. Really good anime, really worth your time. So yeah, let's just jump into the video. All right, so here we go. Yep, he's definitely going after him. And the match has ended, so technically what he's doing is really bad. And he's really about to kill him. Disappear. Boom! You got Magna, Asta, and Luck already. Look at their faces, man. This is the best shit ever. Go on, take one more step toward him. But you should know that the second you do, you're dead. Oh my gosh. You're going to pay for this. Look at them all. Look at them all. Everybody's there. Everybody is there. Like, that's the end of it. But Noelle comes over and goes to save Finral. And then Finral's obviously okay if you guys have watched the later episode. Sorry if that's another spoiler for you guys. But that was just... Like, isn't that amazing? Like, can we go back real quick? Let's just go ahead and check this out. This scene right here just explains it all. Like, I mean, it's a little blurry. But, okay, let's go back a little bit more. So, like, if you look, you could just see... All of their faces. Look at that. Look at that. And look at that. And then look at his. Like, his is menacing. But theirs is just... Theirs are more menacing. Because they're there to protect their friend. Like, that is why anime is so inspiring to me. And it's so good to me when I watch it. When I watch anime, it's not because I watch anime just for uh, the entertainment. The animation. Like, all of these people who watch Seven Deadly Sins care about the animation. Like, it's the last thing. And I'm not saying everybody's like that, but there are a lot of sticklers out there who don't like it specifically for the animation. But that's not what anime is about. I know it's in the word animation, anime, but that is not why I watch anime. Maybe everybody's different, but when I watch anime, I watch it for the story. Like Baruto, I know people can say that's boring. I know people could say that's ass because it's nowhere near Naruto's level. But they're different people. It Literally, Baruto exclaims plenty of times... In the show that he is not his father he is his own self like I don't understand why people have to compare so much to other animes like I know the animation's not amazing in seven deadly sins but that's not what that show is about at all at, at all that show is just phenomenal on its own like I have not watched the new season so I cannot judge basically like based off of just my uh, opinion but I can judge based off of the first couple the first three seasons or first two seasons depending on how you watched it it's just it's amazing. Like, that show is great. And I'm so sorry for my muffled voice. But, like, tell me you guys did not enjoy Seven Deadly Sins just purely for the storyline. Like, I love that show. And I love the action in it, no matter the animation. It sucks when shows have bad animation, yes. But that is not... That doesn't decrease my, uh, like, rating. Like, it, if you have great animation, yes, it'll increase it by a boatload. But it won't decrease it. It won't, like, take away from your, like, amazingness. Like, your ability to, like, wow me and make me feel like I'm actually there watching, like, sitting there fighting with Meliodas. Fighting with Elizabeth. Fighting with all of those people. Like, it's the same with fairy tales. It just, it just aggravates me. This show is amazing. Be sure to check out Black Clover if you did enjoy this scene and you guys haven't seen any of this show. I apologize, but definitely go check it out. 
because it was amazing. Anyway, guys, that's going to end up the video here. If you guys did enjoy it, be sure to hit the like button. If you guys want to see more fight scenes like this or reactions to fight scenes, let me know down in the comments down below. I will see you guys in my next video. Deuces!